total atomic annihilation. Just Nick of Gaming. This is Nick here. Today, we have another episode of Steam Demolition. Today, we're going to be checking out a game called Lost Traces, Unsolved Cases, False Awakening, Prologue. So this is going to be a little taste of a big epic saga that's being developed by a company called Sitting Duck Productions. It's going to be a first-person horror game. We're going to be taking the controls as a young woman named Evelyn Storr. After she receives a mysterious message from her brother, it's off on something that's going to be basically a very eventful night that's going to set, well, a great deal of mystery in the ocean. Let's start here. Sweet home. Okay, so graphically it doesn't look bad. The movement feels little little sluggish here. Kinda nice to have a little bit of something there and all those black screens. Is that music coming from Evelyn's room? Okay. Like right mouse to interact. Is anyone alone? Mom? Dad? I'm upstairs. Okay, well somebody's here. Uh super dark. Any light switches? No, apparently the Stroms cannot afford lights. Well there are lights, it's just Apparently we got them 40 watt bulbs in there. Hey V, it's me. Can I come in? I'm kinda busy with work. Mind if I catch up with you in a bit? Sure, no rush. Oh, by the way, have you seen mom and dad? She's in the kitchen. Probably prepping a meal or something. And last time I seen dad, he was in the garage, working on something. Thanks, I'll go have a look. See you in a bit. Hey, by the way, what are you working on? Anything interesting? Oh, I got a new job at a local news station. I'm hired as a reporter. You know, newspapers, radio, that kind of jazz. No way, that's great news. Yeah. I'm on a case about mysterious disappearances in our quiet community. Or something like that along the lines. Disappearances? Hmm. Seems like a lot has happened since I was gone. Oh yeah. It's unnerving really. 
People have been vanishing without a trace, leaving behind worried families and a community on edge. The police are working hard, but the answers remain elusive. Sheesh, that's unsettling. Any leads or theories? Not much. It's like they've evaporated in thin air. I've been interviewing families. Okay, this is to way together, too much talking. But it all leads to dead ends. Hmm. Well, be careful, Evie. It sounds like a challenging assignment. Well, anyway, I'll let you get back to work. I'll catch you later. Uh. Okay, I think we froze up. I hit tab to go into inventory. And I broke the game. Okay, let's... Let's see if we can restart. Okay, so, uh... I think the inventory button might be a little broken, because, yeah, it keeps freezing up the game. And I guess we can't go down that hallway. It is, I guess, just too dark for us. So let's move on. And can we... Hey, Mom, I'm back. Hey, the hum. Oh, the hum, honey. Uh, How was your time in the army? It must be weird. It now it's over now. I've been all right. It's oh. just strange coming back after 12 months of duty and hearing all about these disappearances. Yeah. Oh, okay. It's been worse sometimes for everyone. No one knows what's happening. Yeah, and on top of that, Evelyn's working on that story for the news station. Yeah, your system has been digging into it. Try to find some answers. But you know, these things take time. Any idea how it all started? Not really. It came out of nowhere. People fan sing with hot trace. And now, the whole town is on edge. Well, I hope Evelyn gets to the bottom of it. I'm here now. Maybe I can help in some way? Henning, <laughs> they could be one of later. Your family misses you, and your sister could really use some help. Oh, speaking of which, Mom, I ran into Mr. Blackwood on my way here. He actually approached me with a job offer, something about working as a security guard at his cottage. Strangely, he didn't dwell into many specifics. A security guard for Mr. Blackwood? That's interesting, Anna. You see, he's a significant figure in our community. He's well-connected and well-respected. This opportunity could really open some doors for you. Let us know, but in a low run as well. And not only that, I bet the payment is really good. Hmm. Why don't you go speak to your father about it? After all, he and Mr. Blackwood serve a close friendship. She might be able to offer insights that could help excite whatever to take that door out. Oh, you're right, Mom. I forgot about that. By the way, have you seen Dad? I am pretty sure he's seen his garrets. Fixing some stuff, you know him. Always got something to tinker with. I'll go check on him. Thanks, Mom. Oh. What the? Okay, I have so many questions right now. What the hell was the explosion? I'm hoping that's a placeholder asset. That is the weirdest one I've ever seen, though. What the heck? Okay, I don't know. That was way too much chatting. Okay. Uh. We don't have a flashlight. Okay, I guess the light up here went out. Okay, this is... I'm... I'm kind of speechless. Can I pick up that lantern, please? No, okay. Oh, where's the garage at? We open it? No, not from out here. There. 
There's not a door here. I don't think there's a door there. Okay, now this door works. Oh, y'all need to mow grass bad. Oh my god. Hey, do I want to walk in here? Guess who's back? Hey, Adam, how are you, my son? I hope you've been all I right all this you. time away. And that might be a good it's thing. It's been great, Dad. But I'm glad I'm finally back. Do you need a hand with that? Uh, no, I'll be fine. Um, Dad, how would you feel if I'd be a security guard for Mr. Blackwood? Blackwood, uh, Well, that's interesting. How do you feel about it? Do you think you'll be up to the task? N not sure, really. I thought maybe you'd know more, considering your friendship with him. Well, you see, Adam, Blackwood is a bit tight-lipped about his affairs. But the job from him is likely a good opportunity. He doesn't involve with anyone in his businesses, even close friends like me. Mom mentioned in my open doors for me with his connections and all. Yeah, your mom's got a point. You see, Blackwood knows a lot of influential people. If you take the job, it would indeed lead to something more substantial down the line. Yeah, I'm considering it. I just wanted to get your take on it first. Well, if you decide to accept, just do it your best. And remember, opportunities like this don't come around every day. Speaking of jobs, Evelyn mentioned she's got a new gig at a local news station as a reporter. Yeah, she got hired a bit after we enlisted. Well, she's realistically given some mysterious disappearances in town for your current story. Hmm. Something like this could be a heavy subject. I heard journalism can be risky sometimes. Do you think it's safe for her? That's what I was seeking too. But she is determined to get to the bottom of this. But I worry for your safety. Eh, I've heard stories about reporters getting into dangerous situations. We need to make sure she's taking all the necessary precautions. Exactly. We'll keep an eye on her. Make sure she's not diving in too deep with a direct protection. Family looks out for family, right? Well, anyways, Dad, it was great catching up with you. I'll go check on Evelyn now. Oh, Adam, before you go. Here, take this. It was your grandfather's and now it's yours. Who knows? Might come in handy in the future. Oh, Dad. I appreciate hey. that. Thank you very much. All right. I'll see you in a bit. Can I use the flashlight? Oh my god, yeah, uh. Okay. Okay. I'm guessing you're a placeholder asset as well as the voice, because that was. Can I leave? Okay. E. Dad? You have a key? Maybe? Somewhere? Alright. Alright guys, so after several attempts, yeah, I cannot get past leaving the garage because the game crashes every time upon the low screen. Uh, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna call it in there. It's a demo, so it doesn't necessarily represent what the final game's gonna be. There's still work being done. Uh, so, uh, maybe we'll wait a little while, we'll come back and check this demo after it's had some updates. Maybe... Maybe whatever's been wrong will be fixed. The regular scene to be updating, looking at the page for it. But, yeah, just in that little bit. It needs a little work. A little work, but we'll come back at a later time, possibly, and hope some things got figured out. Alright, so thanks for joining me, guys. I do appreciate y'all. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share. Helps out the channel a lot. I'll see you guys next time for some more Steam Demolition.